What's up, everybody? This is uh, You Seen That. Go by the channel Hollywood. How are you guys doing today? Uh, as promised, today's video is going to be about Bodega Dreams. It's a book I read. It's pretty good. I'm sitting outside in my neighborhood. You know, it's one of the project buildings. It's a rough place, but I call it home. So, Bodega Dreams is about. Uh, young man named Chino and he grows up in Spanish Harlem and you have the guy Willie Bodega and his partner and they are pretty much like the angels the guardian angels of the whole community and they're trying to pretty much get Chino to become a part of their group Unfortunately, they are a part of a lot of illegal practices, you know, selling drugs and a bunch of stuff like that. And what ends up happening pretty much in the shortest terms is uh, Willie Bodega is in love with Chino's wife's aunt. So he's been in love with her since forever. So the plot of the story is he's trying to get Chino to set up a meeting where he can, you know, rekindle the ember that he had with his wife's aunt. His Chino's wife, by the way, whose nickname is Blanca, she is a very religious individual, goes to church a lot, and, um, you know, they have that difference, but they seem to make it work out. Um, so, throughout that story, you know, that's what the gist of the story is, trying to get them two back together. Uh, he has a best friend named Sapo, who's like, you know, a street guy. They grew up together, so he's always, you know, watching his back and stuff. And um, they end up having like a drug war. I know this is probably all over the place, but I'm just trying to get this as clear as possible. But they have a drug war and, you know, deaths happen. And that ties into a lot of things. But the plot of the story, like I said, you know, he helps him rekindle the flame with this lady, this woman, who ends up, you know, leaving her husband for him. But what happens during that whole altercation, she shoots him, like she murders him. And, you know, Bodega's partner, he is a lawyer. So, you know, he, she figures, you know, Willie Bodega is gonna take the rap for it, and you know, they're gonna figure it out. What ends up happening is crazy twist. She was in love with his partner the whole time. So when she kills the man, and you know, his partner is supposed to help him out, they end up killing Willie Bodega and they just take the whole empire for themselves and you know right up in the sunset however chino gets the inside scoop on everything and ultimately he pretty much snitches them out and gets them arrested and you know that's like the main plot of the story it's a really good book though i like the urban lifestyle that they show and everything overall i really liked it i suggest it it's by the artist ernesto the artist the author ernesto quinones um he's a pretty good author i'm currently reading um chango's fire i believe it's called i'm gonna do a review on that next so i hope you guys enjoyed the video once again let me know your thoughts comments how you how you thought this one was played out try a different scenario it's probably a little windy hopefully this won't affect the video so much so thanks for stopping by. Uh, tomorrow's video will be about some health things that I got going on. Actually teaming up with somebody to start a whole new routine. I'll give her a shout out on the video. Um, once again, if you'd like me to use one of your music um, videos or your songs on the video, feel free to drop a message. If it's good, I'll definitely use it, give you some recognition. Um, I'm still working on that list of YouTube uh, subscribers that I follow. There's a bunch of them. I'll have that down soon enough. Um, so thanks for your time. Feel free to subscribe, drop a like, drop a dislike. Make sure you guys leave a comment if possible. 
I really love to have your opinions on these videos that I'm making. Um, the editing is getting better. I think I fully got that down. And I'm working on some graphics now to get a bumper going and a good intro. So thanks for your time. And hopefully I will see you tomorrow. Peace.